infrastructure because the trams are back. The trams are back. <laughs> so we're currently heading over there right now. It's around like five in the evening. And yeah, we're not gonna take our alternate route. We're gonna actually just go down the escalator so we can go through security and then get on the tram. I think we will maybe take this way the way we used to go uh -huh. on days where we have like a we start off here. But for days where you just kind of show up, the trams are so convenient. No more walk. No more walking. Also in the way. Get out of the way. All right. <laughs> See you guys on the ride. Go. <laughs> First stop here for us, because I'm hungry, is the Golden Horseshoe. Just gonna get a little bit of a snack, I don't know. And then we'll see what we hit. I'm just getting a snack because we have the lamp light at 8.30. It's cold outside. It feels so good though. It's hot though. Uh, all right, I'm gonna go get my food. Yep. As a reminder, remember guys, now at Disney, you don't have to wear your masks indoors. Mine's only off because I'm about to eat and I'm in the corner separated from everybody. So remember that when you come. You already know I had to pick up this Mickey Sunday. Even though it's freezing outside. And it's falling apart. Look at it. It's alright. And then I got my chicken tendies and some honey mustard. Alright. I'm saving my appetite for the bye bye night. Alright. We went ahead and picked up. I don't know. Particle punch. Particle punch. It is non-alcoholic. It's got pineapple. It's not. It's, I, I guarantee you, it's got Sprite or something. In it. But it's pineapple. It's got pop rocks on the top. Pop rocks. Okay, take a taste. It's. It's. <laughs> that is exact. Exactly what flavor of Sprite I want. Pineapple Sprite. It's very good. Do you recommend it? What do you rate it? I think the Pop Rocks uh, unnecessary. I don't know, I'm not a Pop Rocks fan. Mm. I'm not a Pop Rocks fan. I'm not a Pop Rocks fan, but they're alright. You want to take a taste? Uh, sure. People over here looking at me like I'm a weirdo. It's good. All right, we gotta go to our lamplight lounge reservation. Hopefully, we sit inside and not outside. It Hopefully, is chilly. I'll See you later, Mater. Later, Mater. Later, Mater. I'm going to take. Hey, everybody. You see him? <laughs> yeah. Woo. All right, so as we take a walk to Lamplight Lounge, first announcement for April is. My mom and my sister are coming down and they will be going to Disney for the first time. They, they haven't been in a long time. So they're gonna come down. We're uh, doing Disney one day and... And then DCA 
So we're doing two days, one park each day. I think we're gonna buy Genie Plus too, test it out, see how well it works. And because Ashley will be turning 21 years old, I got her reservations for Blue Bayou, I got her reservations for Lamplight, and I got her reservations for Carthay and Trader Sam's. Spoiling her. Yeah, we gotta go all out for her. If we're gonna do a 21st at Disney, it's gotta be special. And then announcement for a little bit later this year. We'll actually let you know about that once we get to Lamplight. Oh, okay. So we're gonna keep you on better. edge. We're gonna keep keep. <laughs> Announcement number two. So later this year, for my mom's 50th birthday, even though it's not going to happen in July, but in September, we are going to go back to Florida for Disney World round two. Round two. And what's crazy is we, we started off the 50th celebration over there, and now we are ending their 50th celebration. That is very... It's literally like a <laughs> month until the... Because we went in October. I think October 1st is when the 50th started. Yeah, September, little... we're going September 16th? Yeah. And it would end on October 1st. So I think that's pretty cool. And oh. we're staying on Disney property this time. Yes, we're not gonna make, I mean, it, the mistake last time was the rental car. Yeah. But this time we're actually gonna stay at a Disney World hotel. This is a pretty nice room. It's a nice room. We're going to stay at the Port Orleans and we're going to have the, the, the River View of the, the Port Orleans. Royal, it's the River View Royal Room. Yeah. If you look it up online, it has basically like Tiana everywhere and like princesses. It's very cute. Yes. It's a two bedroom suite. We'll be sharing it with his mom and Ashley, which perfectly fine with that. And then they do have a couple of restaurants there on site. So we'll cover those for you guys as well. Yep. And this will be my second time staying at a Disney resort. Last time I stayed at Coronado Springs. That's a really nice resort. I'm excited to stay here though because I know my mom has been wanting to stay yeah. at Port Orleans. And on top of that, what's really cool is we can take like a water ferry to the resort. Mm -hmm. to, so, the, to different parts, sorry. So we can go to um, Disney Springs. We can go to, I think, Magic Kingdom. And then I think the ferry also takes us to the... The boardwalk, I think. The too. boardwalk, yeah. So that's pretty cool. I yeah. I think it's pretty cool. But that'll be in September, so I'm excited for that. Yeah, so stay tuned for that. More Disney World content. It's kind of crazy. Before we went in October, I had only been once. And it was in like 2011, maybe 2010. I'm now going to be going to Florida twice in the same year and staying at a Disney resort. That's just crazy to me. Not the same year. We went October of last year and now we're going in September. In the span of 12 months. Okay, okay, there you go. But yeah, I'm really excited. And I hope my mom and Ashley are excited. I'm sure they will be. I mean, it looked like it was when we showed your mom the room, so. Oh, and in April, when my mom and my sister come down, my aunt is also going to be joining us yes. um, here at Disneyland. So it'll be five of us. Um, and then all those reservations Aaliyah told you about, Blue Bayou, uh, Trader, Sam's, Trader Sam's, Lamplight, Lamplight and uh, I almost called it Carnation, Carthay Circle. Um, yeah, so we're going to have lots of fun this year. And keep in mind, if you're trying to book for your reservations like this, like these restaurants, like this, like this, <laughs> um, book them 60 days in advance. Yeah, we, we were up at like 11 something uh, at night and Aaliyah was just like, they, they go on it's it'll be 60 days from our trip at midnight and reservations opened up and she booked as much as she could so you, you kind of have to be on top of it if you plan to come uh, and get like special restaurant reservations or stuff like that so just heads up i mean you don't have to all the time i think the one the main one is probably blue bayou that you have to do 60 days in advance but keep in mind just you have to check every little while like a crazy person i'm not even kidding like every 30 minutes if you can because people cancel all the time that they're not going to be able to make it and then those reservations open up so yeah yeah they also what's cool about blue bayou is they accept walk-ins so at like 11 you can go up and say hey do you have any walk-ins available it's not always Guaranteed. a hit 
but we did that um, in October. No. We have the link. We'll link it down below for you. Whenever we went last to Blue Bayou and we just walked up and we we're like, hey, do you have a table available? And they did. So. I think it was for my birthday, August. Oh, yeah, it was August. So you can you can try that too. Well, we're just waiting for them to call us now, so. Yeah. I don't know what I want to get now. Because it's cold. I don't want to eat a salad when it's cold. So I'll probably, get a burger. Just, I'll probably just get the hamburger. All it's right. a pretty good burger. Are you going to get the salmon? I'm going to get the salmon sandwich. Salmon sandwich. Oh, yeah. A budding artist in his natural habitat. He just ordered a fine cup of coffee. And I think uh, we're going to get the donuts. It doesn't suck that we're here and we don't really want to eat. Because I like being here, but it's like if you get reservations, I feel obligated to get like real food. <laughs> yeah, me too. I mean, I am hungry, but I'm not. We've been here enough to where I know what everything on the menu tastes like, and I kind of don't want anything. So I don't know. Maybe we'll just have some coffee and uh, oh, no. some potato skins. <laughs> I just think it's also the atmosphere. I love the atmosphere here. It's just so chill. So very adult Disney. And I think you snacked earlier. I don't want you to feel like you have to overstuff yourself. Yeah. Like, we come here more than anybody probably should. <laughs> so it doesn't always have to be an occasion every time we come. So, I don't know. That's true. It is pretty warm in here, unlike last time when we were sitting here and we were freezing. Yep. So. Plus, I mean, the last time we were here, it was for an occasion. Well, it turned out to be for an occasion. Uh, I think it's okay to say now because it's been announced, but I'm going to have a new baby cousin joining my family. That will be uh, my Uncle Chris's baby, and I am so excited. Congrats to Chris and Monica. You guys are going to be awesome parents. Yes, we're so excited for them to be awesome parents. Literally wanting to buy them everything we see for babies. I went to Box Lunch the other day and they had like, they had Vegeta's battle armor and Gohan's kid outfit where he has a hat with the Dragon Ball on it and Goku's gi, but it was baby clothes. I thought it was awesome. <laughs> and then they already have like a... Thank you. I was going to say was... Um, at Box Lunch, they had a little Boba Fett bounty hunter little little jersey for, for babies, and they already had that. I think their kid is going to be dressed, and he's going to be so fly, he or she, but they're going to be so fly, mm -hmm. and you're going to spoil them. Absolutely. So, congrats again, you guys. Again, you guys, I am the second to the oldest of the grandkids, so my cousin, who is the oldest, she's 27, I will be 27. And we're gonna have a newborn. And like the baby of the family is in high school. So you can only imagine how crazy that is. That is such a huge gap. We are so excited. This coffee is penetrating my nose. It looks so good. Look at this bougie coffee. It's in like an artist cup. I know. Mm. <laughs> I don't know, just putting some sugar in my coffee. I want to ask if we can get the peanut butter and jelly roll and then the donuts. And I think that would be okay. And potato skins? Oh yeah, and the potato skins. Okay. Cody ordered off the kids menu because he really wanted this PB and J roll. <laughs> that comes with veggies and some fruit. And they still have the seasonal donuts, the oolong ones. And they come with the side of orange cream, and then we got the potato skins. Mmm, mm. yeah, malicious. Oh, no bees on the carousel. I lied. There's a lot of people on the carousel. <laughs> Hi. Hi. I'm so cold. Yeah, it's been crazy, so it was like hot the other day, and we had to have the AC on, and now it's freezing. 95 degrees, and then all of a sudden, California's like, mm, it's still winter. It's gonna, it's gonna snow in some cities that it normally doesn't snow in. I wish it would have snowed here. That would have been pretty cool. If it snowed at Disneyland, it would be a mess. Oh, yeah. There would be people slipping and sliding everywhere. The 
boardwalk and we won prizes. You always beat me in that rollerball one. I have horses. to, that's my favorite one. And then I got flick. Yeah, Cody did Heimlich's and he had to make three in, but they just gave it to you. They gave, I had two. I think they've only ever seen somebody get two because those things are hard to throw in that little. Yeah, they're really hard. They're like stress balls. Yeah. And then this one I just want to race by rolling a ball. Yeah. That was fun. Woohoo! So here is one of the first booths that is already set up for food and wine. It's the garlic kiss. You know, I've never seen the green stems on a garlic before. On a garlic stuff, really? That's kind of scary. I don't like that. <laughs> It's like, in, like the Twilight Zone or something. I know, over here it's empty. Should we go in the little room? <laughs> it's kind of cold in there. That's true. I mean, we can. I'm down to do whatever you want to do. Look, it's the World of Color projector. Yes, World of Color will be coming back. Do you think they're testing um, when the park closes? Hopefully. I can't wait to see Fantasmic again. Right? It's gonna be so awesome. Hopefully they don't change it too much. Nope. Because then they can bring it back and then they can change it. Mm-hmm. Which one's this one? Oh, this is the one I want to try. It's Cluck a Doodle Move. Oh, and the little weather vane. Okay, so chicken and a cow. It's a rooster and a cow. Cluck a doodle move. I can't wait for food and wine. This will be my first ever food and wine. I'm excited. Booth on the left is avocado time. The signs are really bright. They put a lot of detail. Yeah. This one's gonna have the avocado paleta. Mm. <coughs> avocado. Booth is the artichokes booth. That one also had a couple of good ones on it. I love artichokes. Me too. So good. The peppers caliente. They have um, something with arbol de ch arbol chiles. Oh, those are super spicy. The little not, ones. To me, it's less flavorful than like jalapenos or other chiles, but it's good. I like salsa de arbol. Stinky guy. Did I say that correctly? Yes. Arbol chile. Arbol. <laughs> Uh, we're ending this day where we started this day in the parking structure. It's very cold outside. It's very cold outside. We had a good laugh right now too. Yeah, it's pretty funny. Aaliyah was looking at the haunted mansion candle that's in one of the, it's in trolley treats, and she picked it up and she's holding it like this. And she took the lid and then the, it okay. slipped. The lids are supposed to be secured by tape. So I was turning the candle to see what it had because it had the different tombstones, and when I tipped the candle. The lid fell off, and my instinct is to throw my leg out and try to catch it, right? As a like, for former soccer player over here. And when I did that, I accidentally kicked the candle lid, and it rolled all the way to the front counter on its side, and I was like, oh my god, please don't break. Like, I'll she, buy this candle, but still. She played pinball with it. She kicked it. After she kicked it, it hit one dude in the shin, then it bounced off a stroller, and then it went to this family that was at the counter. And the kid picked it up, and the dad was like, where did you get this? And the mom was like, what is this? And the kid looked so confused. He was like... And I was like, yeah, I'll take it. It came from us. I'm sorry. And they were like, okay. And uh, the whole time, so there was a guy next to me when that happened. And the whole time, I just kept looking down at the candle and was like, avoiding eye like, contact. <laughs> it was hilarious. I could not stop laughing. But That's funny. Anyways, thank you guys so much for joining us. Um, I know I've been kind of late on the whole merch thing. It's just... It takes a lot of energy for me to try to do it. And at least this weekend, I am off. So I will for sure work on it. I will update our website. I'm sorry about that. Um, if you want to support us, we also have the Buy Me A Coffee. The link is below. The link for our shop is below. We do have stickers and keychains on there. Uh, <laughs> um, but yeah, thanks for joining us for another fun day. We'll see you in Disney World again in September. Yep. Not that we're not going to make videos till then, but, I mean, you know. Who knows? What do you mean, who knows? <laughs> I also want to try and get a, a 
have like an actual vlog put out for Florida. Cause last time we went, it was kind of like. I feel okay. So the last time we went, sorry. Before we <laughs> adding on to this, um, the last time we went, it was my first time, and it was like Cody's first time in a while since he had gone. So I feel like we were just really trying to soak up every element of it, and even then, we didn't get like enough time to soak every element up. Like one day at each park is cool, but the weather really makes you not want to be outside yes. and stand in lines. The amount of people that go don't make you want to stand in line. So I feel like. Our trip started off bad, and then it kind of carried into the trip. This time, we're gonna make the most of it because I don't know. Last time it was, I enjoyed it, but I felt like it could have been better. Yeah, especially because at least now we're on Disney property, so we'll have less to worry about. Yeah, plus we'll be central to everything instead of being kind of away from the property, having to yeah. drive off property then back. It, it'll just give us a little bit more time. Yeah. So, excited for that but again thank you so much for watching remember to like comment and subscribe share us with your friends share us with your family share us with some spider-man and who's uh dr strange we saw dr strange pull thor out of the the sanctum earlier it was so cool and with that being said it's time for us to go good night, good night. Bye.